You know everybody's gonna use it. Some people don't drink coffee, some people don't eat chocolate, but I think everybody takes a shower. I graduated high school, went to senior week, and then the next day I came back and I worked at a law office. So I started off um, at a law office right here in downtown York. Um, I really, really did enjoy it, and that's, I believe, where my work ethic started. And then I found myself at uh, Susquehanna Falls Graff. God rest his soul, Louis Appel, amazing, amazing person. I was fortunate enough to work for him, for um, almost directly with him for years. Uh, and then I did have two kids, and that's when I just started staying home. And I thought, oh, I want to pick up a hobby, so I started making soap. And then I found my passion, my whole life's passion. But we just started, um, you know, making soap in, uh, in my house. And then before I knew it, I enjoyed it, so I was cranking out so much stuff. I was like, whoa, what am I gonna do with all this soap? I had hundreds and hundreds of bars sitting around. And uh, I was like, well, let me set up at shows and festivals. Probably like about my fifth year of doing shows. When I came home from a show and I had people in my driveway, I was like, oh, this might be time. Maybe we need to get a type of shop. In the fall of 2005, we got the storefront. Now that was about 200 square feet was there for about five years and then this space opened up and we've been here I believe we're in our eighth year here in this space now this is about 1700 square feet so this is where now we make everything Holler if you guys have any questions okay all right oh we make what I believe are the best products in the world we make everything with love that's the most important ingredient this is a chemical reaction that's happening right now called saponification, the molecules are meeting. It's science every day here. It's probably what we don't put in things. We don't use sulfates, we don't use um, FDNC coloring, and we don't strip soaps of moisture. But we also use a lot of high quality things. Shea butter, cocoa butter, castor, olive, soy, coconut. So we use really high quality ingredients. Um, and everything starts with that just making the best because we feel that, you know, people deserve the best. So everybody likes the scent and everything. When you walk in here, there's a certain vibe, people have said. Um, and it's not just about that. I believe that we're all friendly and helpful, but I believe um, the stuff on the walls and the fun things that surround us, the, you know, the oil paintings from the 1880s and the paintings from the 1930s and the antique soap cutter that's 125 years old. All of these things that my husband and the universe bring to us in here so people can enjoy. I surround myself with great people. Years ago I knew this was beyond just me. So not only do I have the support of a great team here uh, who are helping to make everything and just make this place run very, very smoothly, but of course my family at home. My husband's been a huge help. It's not just me, maybe other people make it look simple, but the truth in fact is nothing is simple. Nothing will ever be simple. Everything's hard work. I think if you find your passion and if you can turn that passion into making a living. That's really the secret to having success in your life.